And so it begins. Despite triple threats being every man for himself, history has shown that the match's dynamics can create unlikely alliances. A participant must be ready to endure double team attacks at any time. Inflicted. It didn't take long for Shinsuke Nakamura to rise to the top of NXT less than five months after his debut. He beat Samoa Joe at NXT TakeOver Brooklyn 2 to become NXT Champion. Before the bell even rang, Nakamura showed why he was NXT's rock star as a live violinist played. By the end of the match, he was also NXT's champion. Ooh. The two of you were discussing Nakamura versus Samoa Joe, a match I was lucky enough to call as part of NXT's commentary team. Those two guys like to hit hard, and the end result showed it as Samoa Joe left the battle without his title and with a dislocated jaw. It was just the start of their rivalry, which would include even more brutal matches and two more title changes between the greatest strikers in NXT history. No matter what tool you're using to gauge its impact, Adam Cole appearing at NXT TakeOver Brooklyn 3 changed the entire NXT landscape. Just ask Drew McIntyre and the other losers who've fallen victim to Adam Cole. Beautiful technique. What a stomp. Good grief. Not too long ago, Corey brought up Adam Cole's historic debut attack on Drew McIntyre. The devastation that followed that attack was an incredible display of strategy and strength at every level. I've been ringside for hundreds of NXT broadcasts, and still, I can't recall the last time a superstar debuted during a main event, along with a powerful faction like Cole did with the Undisputed Era. This might be it! Oh my! Hooked up, and... Without a doubt, this is a volatile situation, guys. WWE superstars are dangerous without weapons. Then you put them in an environment like this, and who knows what you're liable to see. You gotta believe this one's over! This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Roman Reigns seems helpless. Corey, you mentioned the triple threat rules earlier. Well, this match type became popular in the 1990s. It also went by names like the triangle match in WCW or a three-way dance in ECW. When we talk about a triple threat match, something else about the stipulations that's important to include is that the match can also be contested under elimination rules. For more than 25 years, triple threat style matches have been mainstays in sports entertainment. Triple threats are utilized to crown a champion, establish a number one contender, or just to settle a score between three superstars who can't get along. Triple threat matches have also been decided inside 15-foot-high steel cages with ladders and in tag team competition. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. Byron, before you mention the strategy some superstars have implemented for competing in a triple threat match, and that includes having a finishing maneuver to put someone away for the 1-2-3 and a submission to make them tap out. There are many superstars in WWE who can do just that, which makes them even more dangerous to opponents. The way I look at it is you can never have enough weapons at your disposal especially in something like a triple threat match. If a superstar can defeat someone by pinfall and submission, to me, they increase their chances of victory in a match where the odds are against them to begin with. Incoming. Yeah, let's hope he can keep this kind of effort going. He wants no part of the outside.
As we've seen in the past, Extreme Rules matches create a type of hysteria that's difficult to describe, even more difficult to contain. Shinsuke Nakamura just too fast for him. It's like trying to fight smoke. Shinsuke Nakamura beginning to look a little tired. Guys, he's going to have to turn things around quickly if he wants to win this thing. I'd have to agree with what Byron's saying. When you've got action taking place all over the arena, complete with every weapon imaginable, it's not easy to keep up. Well, try, Cole. That's what you're getting paid for, isn't it? Oh, boy, he is rolling. Now that's how you use a table to your advantage. There's no doubt Roman Reigns has a long career in front of him. But guys, if he chose to hang him up today, I'd say he's a surefire Hall of Famer. Gets out of the way of that one. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Focusing more on Michael's Hall of Fame argument, I definitely agree that Reigns belongs. Just look at everything he's already done, from WrestleMania made events to WWE Championship Reigns and everything in between. It seems like a silly argument if you ask me, but hey, I'll play along. I'll also agree. Roman Reigns is a slam dunk Hall of Famer. Heck, to get the shoulder up. Look at the look on his opponent's face, Cole. He can't believe it. Of course, Extreme Rules matches have resulted in some gruesome moments over the years, and perhaps none was more gruesome than in 2012 when Brock Lesnar busted John Cena open following a vicious attack. Oh boy, he is rolling. You only got one. Make the last shot count. This could be the turning point. Now, this right here is exactly what Adam Cole is waiting for. Cole knows when to pick his spots. Oh, he's able to reverse it. Oh, oh man! Max Handel finds the mark. Impressive series of moves. Looks like nobody's budging, Cole. He oh, a kick to the face. This one's over, guys. What grace. Float over into the top. Break your crown. Nakamura, beautiful technique. What an assault on Roman Reigns. Oh, man. Roman Reigns doesn't even know where he is. when there are no count outs. Now that's a display of excellent ring awareness. Nicely done. And this has got to be it. One. Never say die attitude out of him. Two spear. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. This is exactly what Roman Reigns needed. He's got him covered. One. Uh-oh. 
We know what Reigns is looking to do here. Counter here. Oh, Roman Reigns may have it. Oh, Roman Reigns unable to be contained. Trying to make a comeback. There is no toppling the Roman Empire. He's firing on all cylinders. Oh boy, he is rolling. to me like these superstars are on their last legs here. Oh, nasty impact. Shigeru Katsuki. What a shot. He's calling for it. If he sticks this, he is done. And it's Adam Cole showing some agility. Roman Reigns just too fast for him. Avoids trouble there. What a hellaciously physical match these gladiators have put themselves through. The this might be it! Oh my! Just when you thought he had nothing left. Roman Reigns could do it! Uh-oh! Two. Two! And he got a near fall out of it. Wow, if you want to beat Roman Reigns, you've got to finish the job. No quit in that superstar. What a stop! Great! Superstars have tried everything. They have something left in their arsenal. They have to, but can they dig down deep enough to find it? Here's where one of these three superstars needs to make a statement and win this thing. Roman Reigns just too fast for him. Escapes trouble there. He's making a statement here with this attack. What a slam! Impactful will jar your spine. We know what's coming here. Oh boy, he is rolling. You only got one. Oh, but he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Roman Reigns just too fast for him. What's this? What a driver. Oh, be landed here. Dug down deep and gets the shoulder up. What a match.
Things are not looking very good right now. Gonna have to find a way to regroup. Big time slam. Vicious. Oh boy, he is rolling. He can't withstand one bit more. At what point do those thoughts creep in of, what do I have to do to put this match to rest? I don't know. I don't know as a WWE superstar if you ever have those thoughts of self-doubt. Well, oh, going to the top, high risk. Showing some agility. Whoa. He wants it one more time. Superman punch! But can he follow up here? This is exactly what Roman Reigns needed. All the moment. He goes for the cover. An easy kick out for Adam Cole. Close call. Serious damage. Reigns has identified the target. Stand by. Spear. Cut him in half. That might have done it, Cole. And he goes for the pen. Two. And he got a near fall out of it. Yeah, but he's hurt, guys. Oh, my lord. spot here guys he simply needs to find a way to regroup DDT Ooh, there's the kick second row followed by oh, what impact this one is oh look at that this could be it. Two. And he's able to get out. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Slam down hard. Say, but it's true here. It ain't over until it's over. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. He's making a statement here with this attack. Ooh, what an impact. Can he finish him off here? Now, this right here is exactly what Adam Cole was waiting for. Cole knows when to pick his spots. This might be it. Oh, my. What an assault on Roman Reigns. Going for the cover. One, two, three. Against all, he's got the victory.